All right, guys, we are back with the third episode of Heavy Rain. Uh, let's just continue where we left off. Uh, recording this about a week later, maybe five days after the last episode. Um, well, last night, last episode. I'm recording this the day after episode two goes live. But now we are at the police station. We did see a little bit of this, didn't we? I don't know. Is this the same guy? Let's get the formalities out of the way so I can get back to some real work. Do you think it's going to take long? No, he should be finished soon. So impatient, God. God, I'm bored. I hate having nothing to do. But. I gotta see Captain Perry. Orders are orders. Gee, I hate internal politics bullshit. Okay, let's we'll see what we can see on Ari, because Ari's usually got some good stuff on him. Can usually see what's going on around. Oh, what's this? I didn't see this before. I need to make sure I need to just make sure my microphone's actually uh it's actually capturing my desktop audio. Audio input, yeah, audio output, yeah. Audio input, microphone, cool, we're good. What am I doing? Oh, we got... Okay, that's cool. I like that, I rate that. Am I just wasting time at this point? I feel like the game is just trying to uh, mess with me. Like, just extending gameplay. Alright, surely that's done now. I could go for a little airy time right about now. We just did. Just, oh, okay. Anything interesting this time? We don't need to just throw a ball. It seems a bit like a waste of time. Oh, here we go. Is this who we're after? Nope. I'm off, Charlene. I'll look at the reports later. I'll cancel all appointments for this afternoon. Okay. No. Oh, Captain. Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. Yeah, I'm right here waiting for you. You can't make Jayden, me wait. of course. We've been expecting you. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Do you mind tagging along? We can talk as we walk. Yeah, of course. Do I it. wanted to introduce myself before getting started, but uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, no, now it's fine. We just have to get to the press conference. Press conference. Oh. Believe me, it's not always easy finding Assuming the press conference is about the origami killer. Oh. Have you met Lieutenant Blake yet? Yeah, we met this morning. He has his own methods, but he's a good cop. I'm sure you'll get him well together. Do you know how to tie a knot in a necktie? I guess. Wow. Is this what I'm doing in my life right now? I done without the FBI on this one, but the press. They're all over us. This origami killer case crept up on <laughs> us, and it's fast becoming a national concern. There are hundreds of killers in this country, but what do you origami know? killer. Is exotic. Why am I doing this guy's tie? Origami figures. Work that one out. Then the press get onto it, and we suddenly become the center of the universe. All right, cool. That's done, right? I'm here Lovely. to arrest a serial killer. With all due respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. I've raised honesty. Oh. He's an honest man. Of course not. All I'm asking is that you make progress and fast. The press want to perpetrate. Has good and quality. We're have to like good serve graphics. Him up on a silver platter. Hmm. Not bad. Obviously not bad. Genius, mate. Absolute genius. Oh, go see Charlie and she'll show you to your office. Yeah, check in on the press conference if you're interested. It'll give you an idea of the political climate around here. Oh, politics. Thank you, sir. Welcome to the club, Jaden. You still love politics. Not anymore. Since about 2015, I have no more interest in politics. Captain Perry is doing his press conference now. Might be interesting to have a look. I guess we'll go in there. I think I need a good cup of Java. Do you get Java from in here? No. I saw Blake when I arrived. Maybe I should go talk to him. Take this man's seat. Oh. The 
body of Jeremy Bowles was found this morning on a patch of wasteland in the East End at about 6.30 a.m., five days after he was reported missing. An autopsy will be conducted tomorrow to determine the exact cause of death. Origami. Going from first indications, it would seem that he drowned. The state in which the body was found suggests the methodology of the origami killer. The investigation should confirm this in the coming days. The police are continuing to work around the clock to find the murderer as quickly as possible. They ain't messing around. I'll field some questions. Yes. You said the methodology indicated another victim for the origami killer. Can you be more specific? This would be interesting to know, actually. What sort of specifics are we looking at? An origami figure was found in the victim's hand. Obviously that. And an orchid was placed on his chest. Okay, fair. His face was covered with mud, but there were no visible traces of violence to the body. Go ahead. Uh, the Zodiac Killer was never identified. Perhaps the origami killer will never be found either. Oh, that's enough. I'm bored now. I don't think there's much chance of that. For the moment... The killer may think he's invulnerable, but in the end he'll make a mistake and we'll be there to arrest him. I'll have a look around the station. Stretch my legs for a bit. I'm dying of thirst. Where's the water cooler when you need one? <laughs> Always the case, isn't it? Perry's assistant to show me my office. I can't wait to get to work. Nice watch. Oh, it's the present we offer to our new lieutenants. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. Aww. It optimizes everybody's time, and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can That's contribute nice. to our fund if you like, or still a few dollars short. Nope. Sorry, I, I don't have any change. No problem. Stingy. Maybe next time round. I feel like I should have said yes. Tim Perry said you could show me to my office. Yes, of course. Follow me. Okay. Again, quite a slow start once again, but hopefully it'll pick up very soon. Where's she going? She just got lost on the way to the office. Here we are. Oh, this is awful. This is this, horrible. This is my office? That's where I was told to take you. If you need anything, you know where to find me. A new office? A bit, a bit grimy. I'm going to lie. Well, I guess we have to make do of what we got. Okay, time to work. Oh, I wonder what work's going to be. Why does it not turn? There we go. Do I just sit down? The, the controls are a bit... Mm. Let's just sit down. Got some paperwork. Oh, oh right. He doesn't, he doesn't need them. I guess that's from the last person. Now, we start... Scratch. Whoa, what, why? What's wrong with the desk? <sighs> he doesn't need a desk. Or he just prefers it there. Fine, I'm getting a bit confused, not gonna lie. I feel like the door just opened. I mean, let's put the put Ari on. See what Ari can find. Anything interesting? Step one. Change the office. <laughs> oh, we're gonna change the whole environment around him using Ari. That's actually so cool. That is amazing. And dangerous. Imagine if that was real. You could do that with anything. I mean, I, I don't want to necessarily use this one. I just want to have a look at the others as well. How do you... Okay. Oh. Hang on. Oh, I don't... Wait. Clear all. Oh, here we go. Press the wrong one. Oi. Guess we have to try it, don't we? Oh, that is so cool. Mate, we're sticking with this one. I don't even care what the other one is. We're sticking with this one. Oh, 
Right, I want to select it. I'm happy with my choice. How did we do that last time? Oh no, it's a solar system. I know I'm messing around with this, but I'm enjoying this. Yeah, we want space. <gasps> Oi. Yeah, that is even better. Maybe about the same, but we'll go with this one. Alright, cool. Let's select it. Alright, cool. We're going with this one then. Can I not go with this? Can I not do this? Can I... Hello? Good, I'm happy with my... my I'm happy with my decision. Guys, what, what am I supposed to do here? I don't want to clear it, because I'm happy with the choice. Alright, oh, there we go, right. <laughs> that was so much, such hard work. Clues. We did find some clues, didn't we, when we were going tire tracks. The killer's car is probably a Chevrolet Malibu 83. Uh, probably. 96% chance. Origami. No prints or specific clues. Hmm. Nothing much to go on. Disappointing, mate. You're a terrible detective. Orchid. This is the flower, isn't it? Symbol of innocence. Common species. Mm. A common species. That doesn't help much. It's quite a slow pace, you know. What have we got here? Oh, they're the tire tracks. So let's do a geo analysis then. Before let me uh, skip this bit. No data for geo analysis. I feel like this one might. Okay, the so it's showing you where species. the orchids are. Any flower shop. Yeah, because everyone has loads of flower shops in their neighbourhood. Yeah. I doubt this is going to have anything. Oh, it might. Just one origami store in town. Ah. One origami store. Okay. I like it. Well, let's back them out. Get the files. That's so weird, isn't it? But it's so cool. Considering this game came out ten years ago, it's really cool. Victims. Eight victims in the last three years. One of them was a kid. All boys, aged between nine and thirteen. Oh wow, they're all kids. No signs of violence. The victims disappear huh. from nine public and places 13. in broad daylight. This no sounds very similar to how his kid died. Bodies are found three to five days later. Drowned. In rainwater. Oh, so strange, because his kid was probably about nine, wasn't he? There's always a railroad line adjacent to where the bodies are found. It's so strange. And all the victims disappeared in the fall. Why? So this is showing all the kids have been the killer killed. killer has a large comfort zone. He gained confidence rapidly and moved away from his base. Oh, this won't make the geo-profiling any easier. Uh, I mean, we know the shop was in the top. That doesn't really make much of a difference, does it? So I guess we move to the uh, the next one. Always the same ritual: an origami in the hand, an orchid on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found. Which I thought it said three to five days. Several days before being drowned. Over three thousand five hundred people questioned. Over 100 suspects interrogated. Jesus, 100. Not a single lead to go on. Geo analysis, mate. Do your geo analysis. 
Like you've already got some some stuff there. I feel like we need to go back to the um Back to the clues. I know we've already done them, but I think we need to go back to the clues. I'll have to do the environment first, because I've already done that. Oh no, that's we don't need <laughs> That's just changing how we do kinda where we're sitting. So let's go back to the clues because we might now we've got that map narrowed down, we might have some more information. We can we can narrow some of them out, can't we? We can Oh, maybe not. Alright, I think we're done with Arry then. Map's done. Cool, we're done. I'm gonna just scratch something on my cheek. What's happening, bro? Oh my. What's going on with this guy? He doesn't know very well at all. Look at his face. my face. Here we go again, what's going on? I mean he's a bit shady but I don't think he's a schizophrenic or anything. He did say he was uh water. Right. I know I can make it. I know I know I can make it I don't know what Trippio is, I'd rather not take it. Don't take anything you're not sure about. Is everything all right, sir? He's really struggling there. No one, no one will see. They're gonna see. Look at you. Oh. Okay, I've got to hold it while I'm walking. So where are we going? Do we just leave? This is mad. I'm assuming we just go to the exit, but okay, good. Oh, he's back in the office? What is that? Whatever it is, I don't like it. Like, anything that makes you do that, you shouldn't do. I mean, if we were just walking towards the exit, though, how comes we're just back at the, uh, back in the office? Excuse me, my ideas, because I've got a bit of a blocked nose, and I think I mentioned it once before. Is that him? No, this oh, is Lieutenant oh Blake, Ethan. Marshall. Could you please tell him what happened? It, it was this afternoon. I went to the park with my son, Sean. We played together for a while, and then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden horses. Yeah. And when I turned back, Sean had disappeared. Exactly what time did you arrive at the park? Try to remember exactly, okay. Mr. Mars. Every detail can be important. It must have been about... Right, we're just going to guess. Fuck it. Five... 30, I think. I'm not really it was getting late, wasn't it? So we'll go 5 30. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? He was wearing a coat. Don't ask me what colour it was. I have no idea. It was like a week ago I played this game. We're going to go green. A green coat. And Is a it? Of pants. Green and black, sure. Black pants. How could Sean have disappeared without you even noticing? Weren't you right by the carousel? I can't remember, I can't remember yeah. exactly. It all happened so fast. You say you took your son to the park at school. But you didn't report him missing until 8.15. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? Yeah. I searched the whole neighborhood for him. I, I thought he couldn't have gone far. It's fair. All right. That's all the questions I, I feel like I got that now. completely wrong, but, I mean... Mars. We'll continue to look for Sean overnight. 
We'll contact you if we have any more questions. Like, it's only been about 20 minutes, probably, in-game. Do, do you think the origami killer... Listen, your son's probably just run off and he'll turn up in a couple hours. But what if it is the origami killer? Well, then we have about four days to find him alive. Damn, he's straight to the point. He ain't messing around, is he? What was he wearing? I feel like it might have been green, you know. I did think about it. But it was like five days ago since I played this, so... Did they find something? No, nothing yet. But they're gonna keep looking through the night. Good. Do they... Do they think it's the origami killer? Everyone's stressed about his origami killer, man. It, it's still too early to say. But it is a possibility. I keep finding myself looking at the subtitles. I need to stop what looking at subtitles. Happened, How could you lose strong like that? Oh damn. You should never have taken your eyes off him. This is what hey, happened for God's before. sake, how hard is it to keep your eye on a child in the park? Why did you leave him, Ethan? Why? He didn't. Wasn't it enough losing Jason? Damn. Just give her a hug, man. It doesn't matter what's going on between you. This is a moment between parents. Yeah. Nah. Bro, what are you doing? Hug her. Like, it doesn't matter what's going on. You've, you've got a bond forever. A uh, tie forever. You can't not mourn together over even if you break up. Damn, that was cold from both of them. Unfold the moment movement slowly. Ah, oh, it's just a reminder. I can't remember who this guy is. Have we seen this guy before? He was he the detective, right? The private detective. He might have been. Tuesday, eleven fifty-two. Inches. <laughs> it's quite small. Hey. Right. I guess we walk in. Yeah, detective, private detective. Good evening. Good evening to you, sir. Can I help you, sir? Yes. Well, I hope so. Pack of my eggs. My name's Scott Shaw. Yeah, six pack. I'm a private detective. Uh, I'm investigating the case of the origami killer. I I'd like to ask you a few questions. My son is dead, Mr. Shelby. I have nothing more to say. The killer has kidnapped another victim. A ten-year-old boy. Like your son, Risa. I have four days before we find his body on a deserted stretch of wasteland. No one did anything. To save oh, my son. Sam. Excuse me. No. Please. No. Move along, sir. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. You may know something that could help save other people's lives. I was unable to save the life of my own son. So help someone else's. I did not see how I could save the lives of other people. Oh, do you sell inhalers? I'm all out, and at least I won't go away completely empty-handed. In the back of this door, to the right. This guy's an ass. I know he's struggling, but you should do everything you can to prevent it happening to someone else. I don't be a bitch about it. Did he say to the right? He said over this way, didn't he? What? Come on. Asthma spray. Here we go. Good evening, sir. What's this guy? Who's he looks a bit Are shady. You looking for something in particular? Give me what you got in the registry. Don't fucking try anything. Open the registry, you dumb fuck. Oh man. Put the money on the counter. I'm gonna have to do some like fighting here, aren't I? Shit, are you deaf or what? Are you gonna open that fucking register or not? No, sir. You do not have the right to steal that money from me. I have worked very hard to earn it. Oh shit, no, Chris. You cannot have it. Oh wait, we can walk over him. What did you say? You're out of your fucking mind, man. 
You don't get it, do you? I'm gonna put a fucking bullet right between your eyes. Uh, if you don't do what I say. Two ants, this one. Shall not be robbing my register, sir. That money is mine. I ask you now to leave before it is too late. No. Goddamn idiot. No. Register. Don't make me fucking kill you. Imagine. No, sir. Hey, you. No. Come here. No. I said, come here now. Don't move. Hands up. Put your fucking hands up or I'll shoot. I guess we should probably do as he said. He's got a gun, so. Look, it's not worth it. Put the gun down and just walk away. You giving me yeah. advice? I'll yeah. give you some fucking advice. My name's Scott. What about you? What's your name? Andrew. My name's Andrew. Don't panic. Let's just stay calm. Nobody here wants to hurt you. No, we're all just gonna be cool. Yeah. Man, I'm not stressed right now. I'm cool, man. Everything's gonna be all fucking right. Yeah. You don't really want to shoot anybody, do you? I'm sure we can find a way out of this mess, right? Yeah. You're not a killer, are you? You just want a few extra dollars. No blood on your head. Most criminals are like that. I'm not a killer. I ain't no killer. Do you have anyone you care for in your life? A, a girlfriend, maybe? A family? Yeah. A little girl. Oh man, he just wants to look after his little girl, but he's not doing it the right way. I got a little girl. Her name is Jessica. What would Jessica think if she saw you here? Ask Jessica yourself. don't want to see this. What would happen to her if things go wrong? Nice try. For a second there, you almost had me believing. All oh damn, shit. mate! And now, give me the money. Alright, we're getting up in the fight. I wish I hadn't got in the fight in the first place, man. We should have been able to deal with it. Okay, here we go. This is where things go wrong. This is where I get absolutely messed up. Oh, we got him. That was easy. He's not really a criminal, though, is he? He's just... <sighs> Tense. Thousand thank you, sir. I don't know what would have happened if you had Now tell me. Well, this I didn't come by for nothing. Have a nice day. When now tell me. Boy, oh, here we go. Razor, disappeared. I received a letter with a locker ticket inside. Inside the locker, I found this box. I do not understand what it means, but I think it must be a sort of message, message. from the man who took my son from me. Can I? Oh, oh! Can't open the lid apparently. Please, take the box if it can be of any use to you at all. Did no, I don't think it will. Save Rezo, but maybe it will help you find the other little boy. Why was that so difficult? Mr. Shelby. I was beginning to think that there was no good to be found in this place. I can see now that I was wrong. Yeah, too right. I feel like I handled both situations really well. I'm surprised that it's so difficult. Press the indicated button. I'm not pressing. Why am I going to press D on a keyboard? Two forty four AM, one point five inches. Where are we? This doesn't look like Ethan's house at all. It's some sort of artist's house. Looks very arty. Oh wow. Yeah, how's this? Maybe jump to be honest, I'm gonna lie. Nightmare? 
She's not a character we've seen yet, is she? Watch. Very nice. Turn the TV remote off. Not turn the TV remote off, turn the TV on with the remote. Mm -hmm. Let's get up. Just gonna show, tell you guys, it is well hot today. Like, it is like early evening on, on uh, Friday. And it is very, very hot right now. Damn, she got that cake. What sort of flat apartment is this? This is mental. Okay, wash your face, always good. Wake yourself up in the middle of the night rather than just go to bed. Damn, she's like kind of curvy, but like, not. no, nah, she's well slim, obviously, but kind of cute. Right. Well, am I supposed to put the clothes on or what? What I am? Nah, she's well slim, but like good slim. Right, that's enough showering. Alright guys, well I'm back. I had to cut out a good 45 seconds of the video because she got naked. Completely naked and I don't have the software available to me to blur. Nor will I know how to do it anyway. But, um, yeah, my particular editing software doesn't have a blur feature. So we've just cut out a good chunk. But damn, you saw every, pretty much everything except front to bottom. Alright, anything in there to do? Are we done? Are we going to this weather? Let's hope you don't see much, because I don't want to cut it out again. Okay, all good. Lovely. Dee -dee 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 -dee. I'm still confused about why she's doing her morning routine at really early in the morning. Like, why do your morning routine now? Do it in like four hours or five hours after another nap. Mate, how do we just... The light switch just been turned off, yet yeah, the light went off, um, on. Sorry, been turned on, but the light went off, I'm so confused. Alright, no, that's not very relevant. Let's figure out what we need to do. Oh. So she's got a well nice place, you know, not gonna lie. Are we just playing house right now? Make yourself a coffee at three in the morning. Microwave it. Nice, as you do. We're just playing house simulator. No, didn't want anything. Obviously I'm gonna cut out that bit if you ever wanted to, I'm sure it's somewhere online. Probably, uh, you might find it interesting, but I've had to cut that out of the video. Yeah, I feel like the computer was the obvious shout. Let's see what else is around first. Oh, damn. Who was that? You're just tripping. Oh, your fridge. It's telling you you're hungry, mate. Just eat. Bam! New something. I knew that was going to happen as well. I knew she dead on when I called it. How typical. There's someone here. Really? There's someone in the apartment. 
the phone on the desk. I could call for help. Why is she saying the this front out door. Loud? It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Oh dear, we're in trouble here. Where's the phone? Oh shit. Brilliant. She's got the flipping phone. Oh damn. Bro. Bro, what are you doing? You did that? What's going on? I literally did that. Bro. Mate, she is. What, what is going on with this? Oh fuck. Might be in trouble here. I've missed a couple. Usually when you miss like three on these sort of games, you're screwed. Oh damn. Oh he's going for the kill at least. He's not doing anything worse than that. That could have been really bad. Oh lovely. Got him. Oh there's more than one. Oh I moved the whole controller. Oh! Oh there's two of them. Oh my god. Oh, she's doing alright to be fair. She's Amped all over it. Good, get on the other side of him. Oh, oh he, go on, bite his ear off. Oh, let's go. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Ugh. Oh yeah, I don't like this. I feel like they're just here to steal though, I don't think they're doing any more foul intentions. I think they actually want to hurt her really, they just want to get to steal. I like keeping my eyes out if anything's going to happen. Jesus, they are all over her. I guess it's realistic, like realistically they're not going to be able to like... She's not going to be able to get them all, surely. Right, in the bathroom where there's no way out. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god, it's a nightmare. Wow, after all that, I feel like a bit of an idiot now. Heart's racing, though. No? Wow. That whole section was pointless because it never actually happened. A new bonus. Back at Ethan's apartment. No Sean this time, no. Bro, man, he's lost his first son. Now he's going to lose Sean as well. Final notice. Pay your bills. Oh, it's a letter that they get from thingy. When the parents came home from church, all their children were gone. They searched and called for them. They cried and begged. But it was all to no avail. The children have never been seen again. Return to sender, but tell me where it came from. Oh my God, it's the origami killer. We're not going to do too to much more. And find out what this ticket is about. Yeah, we're not going to do too much more because we're probably coming up to about forty minutes now. 
Um, but I guess we'll have a little look, see what we can do in, for the immediate now. How'd you get out? Oh, you can hop the fence, nice. Hop this fence. Hello? Any fence? We can just go into the neighbor's garden, that's it. Can we go over here? Oh wait, there's an alleyway. Nice. We get in the car? Or do we just see what's going on over? What's with the commotion? That's not a very nice thing to do. Come on, guys. It's so unfair to do to a human. Like, that's a human being. Obviously it's a video game, but... I feel like with his condition he probably shouldn't drive. You never know when he's going to black out. He could hurt someone or himself. I like the music when this first started, but the music's a bit repetitive now. They seem to just use the same song over and over again. My microphone alright. The muffler's a bit close. Should be okay testing. Cool. Oh, he's back in uh, where he was before we lost it. Was it Jason? Gonna, gonna have to oh, make no. it through the crowd. I can't, can't take crowds. Just, I'm just not gonna make it. I'm tightening up. I, I can't You'll go make on. it, bro. You'll make it. Don't you worry. No time to waste. I need to find out what's in that locker. Yeah, so go a bit faster, mate. The luggage lock. Oh, I can't make it. Too many people. Yes, you can. Too many people. Mate, don't. I know you're you're struggling. I'm not like being, but you, like, you always can, even if it's incredibly difficult. You can. You can make it, bro. I got you. I believe in you. Oh, he's struggling big time there. Okay, mate. Like, I know you're struggling big time. But I know you can do it, bro. You got this. Keep going. Oh. There you go. That's probably, mate. Honestly, that's probably a better way to do it. You can pretend that nothing's happening. Don't touch people, though. Mate, this is weird. Jason. Dad. Oi. Dad, where are you? No, it's his fault. He. Jason. He ran off. Dad. The balloon. Gotta get the balloon. Jason. Jason, Dad's here. Jason. It's Jason. He's there. Jason. He's not even there. Dad. We know he's not there. You've just seen him. You've got to be kidding. This is driving me crazy. The balloon. Got Jason. 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 The balloon. Got to get the balloon. Jason. How many times are we going to have to do this? Jason. Jason, come back. Jason! Jason! Dad. Yes, right here, bro. Jason! We had to run off, we could have done this ages ago. Dad. Oh, damn. He's losing his mind. He's lost it, man. We'll go back to your therapy appointments. This guy's like, what are you doing? Get 
Jason's not there, he's dead, mate. Got hit by a car, you were there. The lockers. Now I've got to find the right one. Line 18, box number 3. 18, 3. No. Bro. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought. Go the right way. Eighteen three. All right, eighteen's at the end. Is it on this side though? Okay, this is nineteen, so we need to be on this side. It's to my left right now. Like, literally, it's here. Why well, am I not able to? Oh, there we go. No, that's nine, not nine. Wrong locker. Yeah, I know. I literally know which one it is. It's 18 3. Oh, it's because. Damn. Here he is. Oh no. He's got his own box. Excuse me. Damn, wonder what's in there. Anyway, I think we'll probably leave it there. Let me just check the time. Yeah, probably leave it there in a second. Just finish this scene, it's like an autosave. Okay, that's a good stopping point. Um, if you have enjoyed this episode, please leave a like on the uh, video. Please subscribe to my channel so you can see more of these. If you've been watching this, um, I assume if you are watching this, you're probably watching it quite a lot into the future. Um, because there's not really anyone watching the series at the moment, but it's, on my, it's going to be on my channel so that people can go back and watch it as, as, as they wish. And um, yeah, please subscribe to my channel because you'll see there'll be more games like this coming out every now and then. And there'll also be Football Manager. Football Manager content is my number one, um, but I'll do other things on the side as well. Uh, so if you are enjoying, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, take care and goodbye.